guys um yeah here it is i want to say welcome to the channel if you're new hit the subscribe button make an old man happy and uh I just want to say uh, thank you to all the subscribers, uh, new and old. Appreciate you dropping in and commenting. Uh, you know, I really appreciate it. So anyway, today is, I'm going to say it's a review. Uh, it's going to be short. Uh, let me get this into the, the money shot here. This is the product, right? Campbell Hossfield. And I'll let that just, yeah, there you go. Maybe that's better. Doo -doo. Anyway, as you see, it says 50 foot pounds, right? <coughs> I've had this, excuse me. <coughs> I've had this for a little while. And I had my suspicions that this thing was taken off uh, bolts that was quite a bit uh, uh, much more torque than what it was advertised. So what I did was I got this nut here, and hopefully I can show you my torque reading. Now when it goes up to, I don't know why this thing is not focusing. All right. That's 80 foot pounds. You can see it only goes up to 80. Now, I got, I'm going to start with 80 foot pounds because it's registered for 50. But um, I got my, I'm going to start with 80 and see if I get lucky. So I'm going to torque this up. So that's 80 foot pounds. Guys, I hope that you're you're all having a good holiday. The new year is around the corner. And I know that all of you guys have been really good, boys and girls, and uh, got what you you wanted for Christmas. Mass. So what I'm going to do is uh, says he, to give it a you know a Hana shot. I'm going to run this down to the compressor kicks in. I only got a four gallon compressor. It's supposed to be two and a half uh, CFM uh, for to run the tool. I, I don't think that compressor puts that much out, but I'm going to run it down until it cuts in. And then when it cuts out, I'm going to put it on here and give it a shot. Okay. I'm going to bring it back a bit before it clicks the next two, just to give it just, you know, that little bit of a, a head start before it brings up. And I think that would be good. There you go, folks. You know what? I'm not going to bother because it's... It's not an impact wrench. It's not what I bought it for. I bought it for to take out long bolts. You know, once you crack them loose and with my arthritis, you know, you're cranking and cranking with the thing. And sometimes you're in a little bit of a tight spot and you can't. By the time I get that bolt and then you go with your fingers if you can. And that that's the hardest thing for me is small things. I can't do small things anymore. And by the time I get those bolts out, you know, I'm crippled for my hands. So I'm, that's what I bought that for. I was going to get the cordless one, but I didn't have enough money. I didn't want to waste, not waste it, but 
I seen that one there for 60 bucks. So I got that. I figured got the air compressor, might as well use it. But uh, anyway, beat my, uh, I, I suspected it was better than 50. So you've seen it take off an 80 foot pound nut. So yeah, not bad at all. So if you guys is uh, thinking about getting that, that tool, three eighths, but uh, you know, it's definitely worth it. No problem. Anyway, guys, thank you. Uh, hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up on this video if you like it. I know it's not a, you know, it's not fancy, but I just uh, wanted to do a little review or a little test, I should say. But uh, yeah, okay, folks, stay safe and uh, make sure you, uh, you know, ring in the new year and uh, stay safe. Thanks.